Well, I, I guess the most interesting thing is that there's nothing fundamentally wrong with the Earth. So the natural ecological functions or the evolutionary trends which created the atmosphere, the hydrological cycle, soil fertility, biodiversity, they, they're fine, they're intact. But what we've seen is that human beings can interrupt these, these processes. But we, when we interrupt these processes, we actually do that at our own risk. We don't actually hurt the earth over the long term. You know, I, I think I'm hopeful because nature is so resilient, because it's possible to see that the evolutionary trends are still intact and that we can restore large-scale degraded ecosystems. So if that becomes the intention of humanity, then we, we can do it. So that makes me hopeful. Essentially, the camps allow us to bring people together in a safe space to work together to restore natural ecological function, to re-infiltrate and retain moisture in systems. So we, we've learned that it's possible to rehydrate dehydrated biomes. So if we have a dehydrated biome somewhere, that was once moist, but it's now desertified, we need to go there and work. So what's the cheapest way and the most effective way to do that? Go there in a camp and everybody go and play and have fun, but do a little bit of work every day to rehydrate that biome. And we can also use that to grow organic soils. And we can use that to propagate and plant out the keystone species that have been lost. So this is a way for direct action by people all over the world to learn how to do it and then to learn how to do it by doing it. So those who already know and those who are learning about it can live and work together as equals in a very comfortable camping environment. So it's not permanent, it's camp, but that means that when you restore an area, you can move the camp to a, 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 a more degraded landscape and restore that and then go, keep going. And through this method, humanity can restore the earth. And going to the United Nations conventions on combating desertification and climate change, I see no way forward for these giant projects and, you know, so the only way we can restore the earth is we have to do it. So let's go camping, let's have fun, and let's restore the earth. Thank you.